Okay, sorry about that, guys. I have a lot of storage space problems on my phone, and I got a lot of files on my phone, so because that is always cut my videos short, so I have to delete those files just to make videos for video space. So I'm just continuing off where I left off. I was talking about how, you know, it's not normal to see those planes every time you look out a window, whether it's your car window or your house window or whatever the case may be. So I heard a very few TIs mention this tactic and they always say, you know, it's some sort of direct to NG weapon or some sort of frequency being used on you or even um, the one, one other thing I hear them say the most is I think that the chip, the implantar chip and you know, I'm look, I'm not saying that I know for sure that may maybe one of those may be the case or probably all of them who knows maybe the case but i was diving a little deeper into the powers that be the energy who who are named the powers that be you know what i mean i don't i don't say people anymore i call them energy because you know what i mean some of these people i believe are not even alive to tell you the truth some of these people they work with the afterlife you know what i mean they work the out-of-body experiences and all that so i'm just going ahead and just say energy you know what i mean the powers that be i made a video talking about the powers that be and i told you guys that the only people the only energy who knows the true meaning behind the new world order is the energy that controls this earth that controls this planet that controls this world however you want to put it I'm going to say world that controls this world because of the simple fact that they have power. They're supernatural. Some of them aren't even humans. So pretty much what I'm trying to say is how that tactic connects to what I'm talking about with the powers that be is people are saying implant hardships, frequencies, and direct to energy weapons. I think it's fortune telling because think about it. How... If if it's um a thought reading, te if it's a thought reading technology, sometimes you're not thinking. Let me look through this window. I'm not thinking about gang stalking at all. I just look through the window, and as far as I know, sometimes it doesn't even feel like I'm the one who looked. I'm not saying that you know I'm not in control of my bodily functions, but sometimes it doesn't feel like I'm the one who actually looked. It just feels like you know my, I just looked. It's like and it's like when you look. And you see the plane from some weird angle. You're thinking in your mind. Why did I just look and then suddenly, coincidentally, there's a plane passing by? You know what I mean? That's that's not even thought reading because I'm not thinking about looking through the window. It's not something that I think about, something that I just did. So it's either one or the two things. You know what I mean? Body function manipulation or fortune telling. I've heard of fortune telling. It's funny because a lot of people see these fortune teller machines and that can that's like distraction because you know you pay you know that's not real obviously the machines that the fortune teller machines that you see around like in the mall or wherever they are you know what i mean people see those machines and that's just distraction because they, they think that's not true and it's i'm telling you man there's just so much stuff to get into that i just have to find the time to do so but there's so much stuff to get into that I don't even know where to start sometimes the time to make a video because I have so much videos to get into and I, mean, I also want to get into rapper XXS and Tassian and I still haven't even done that yet if you guys want to see um videos on him there's one person who's definitely not letting his story die and I give him his respect for doing that look up the channel Czar, all rights reserved. C Z A R R, all rights reserved. Look up his channel. He does a good job following the Exodus and Tassian case. But um, yeah, that's it for this video. I'm trying to get back to you guys with another video as usual. Thanks guys. Thank you guys for watching. God bless. I'll catch you in the next video.